Hey guys, Tash everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today recipe, I'm going to show you two different way. Migari fish, the one is steam and the one is deep fry. So I'm going to show you how to make this recipe. Alright guys, so here is the ingredient. Ginger and coriander leaves. Green chili, red chili, lemon, and garlic. The chili I chop just different way, ginger and chili. So first we have to wash the fish. Here I'm gonna add one tablespoon salt. And now wash the fish. And we have to remove the upside skin. Not all, just lightly you have to rub like this. The opposite side you have to rub. Like this you have to remove. Now slightly cut the fish stomach and we have to remove the all inside dirty. Be careful, this fish is very delicate. Now you have to remove this all thing. Head and stomach all we need to clean. You just follow the video, it's difficult to explain. You guys know my English is very good. Now I already cleaned my fish. Now we have to cut just slicely. Don't cut the upper, just we need to just um, cut like this. This way all seasoning will go inside so it will by the way, uh, if you don't want to cut, it's your wish. You can directly fry, you can directly uh, steam. Now, this coriander roots I'm gonna use right now, and leaves we gonna use later, and some sliced ginger, and some lemon skin so juice i already pack out we need only skin now this all i'm gonna stuff in uh, fish stomach some upside and some inside so it will keep the nice flavor now it's ready for steam So steam pot, you can use any kind of steam pot. So here I'm gonna use normal steam pot. So now I'm gonna steam for 3 to 4 minutes. So this fish is very easily cooked. And I keep in normal high heat. Alright, now meanwhile we gonna prepare the sauce. Here I add 2 tablespoons garlic and chili, green chili and red chili and some chopped up ginger and also I'm gonna add some sesame seed, lemon juice and some fish sauce and finally I'm gonna add some little bit sesame oil, two drops, it will give nice flavor and little bit sugar and some coriander leaves now it's ready, see how it is simple to make add two tablespoon flour and one tablespoon corn flour and just pinch up salt and mix the all dry ingredient 
And first we need to clean the all extra water. Now once it's completely done, now it's time to apply the flower. So this way the more it will make more crispy. By the way, this is optionally. You can directly fry also. But I like to just apply a little bit more flour. I need a little bit more crispy and golden brown colored looks. Now it's ready for to fry. So here I already heat my oil. Now you have to gently add and just deep fry for until not bottom will golden brown color. And also I'm gonna add some sliced ginger. I like to add a little bit more ginger flour. Now I'm gonna flip it over. So each side I cook the fish for 3 minutes and I keep in low flame because we need to cook inside also. Now you can see my fish is already done. Now take out the fish. Alright, set aside the fish. Now move on to sauce making. So here I add half tablespoon cooking oil. And next I'm gonna add garlic. Try the garlic a little bit. It will change the color. We don't need to cook the properly garlic. Garlic becomes like this color. Now it's time to add green chili and red chili on the same time I'm gonna add 2 tablespoon fish sauce and also I'm gonna add 1 tablespoon normal water a little gravy look I'm gonna, I want so I add 1 tablespoon corn flour water so it will look a little gravy. And finally I'm gonna add 1 tablespoon lemon juice. Now when you add the lemon juice you have to turn off the heat. Now our sauce is ready. Remove the oil before we stop. And so here I garnish with coriander leaves and top on the fish I'm gonna add gravy sauce we just make right now. So this is the my steam fish is ready. So here is the deep fry. So deep fry here I garnish with lemon. I just slice the lemon and just put the side, both the side and top on the fish we gonna add sauce. And that's it. It's very simple. Alright guys, so this is the my final result and hopefully you guys enjoy this recipe. So if you like the, this video, please give it a thumbs up and how it is done, forget to leave comment below. And if you want to know about more recipe, please do subscribe, like, share with your friends and family. 
and thank you so much for watching my video and we'll see you in next video bye bye